Note, in the beginning, you have to ensure that the connection between the plug and charging port is not loose. Your charger should also be secured to the socket as well. Also, if your MSI laptop cannot charge when the battery level is 90% and above, you don't have to worry. Take charger into account. Your laptop's charger normally comes in two parts, the power cord with the plug pins and the power adapter with a charging pin. Start inspecting the plug pins for damaged pins. Next, determine whether the charge is damaged. If the charger is damaged, you will have to purchase a new one. While shopping for chargers, you should pay special attention to voltage. Give charging port some thought. For smooth charging, the charging port must be in good condition and free from dust. To clean off the dust, use a dry cotton bud. After you finish cleaning, plug in the laptop and see how things turn out. If the charging port is loose, you will have to send it in for repair. Update battery drivers. Step 1. Press Windows plus R to open run. Step 2. Type dvmgmt.msc, then hit Enter to open Device Manager. Step 3. Click View, then select Show Hidden Devices. Step 4. Hit the arrow beside Batteries, then right-click your battery driver. Step 5. Select Properties, then go to the Driver tab. Step 6. Pick Update. Driver, then follow the on-screen instructions to update the drivers. Step 7. Once the process concludes, restart your computer. Battery Calibration Step 1. Close all open windows, then connect your laptop to the socket. Step 2. Go to Search Bar, type MSI Battery, and pick MSI Battery Calibration. Step 3. Once the software has done a pre-check, hit Start to start running the software. Step 4. After all the process is done, your laptop should resume charging. Change Power Plan. Step 1. Right-click the battery icon on the taskbar, then select Windows Mobility Center. Step 2. Navigate to where the battery is located, then click the drop-down menu. Step 3. As you switch to each plan, check if the battery is charging, and when you see one that works, stick to it. If the problem happened following changes to the power plan settings, you can restore it to defaults. Step 1. Press Windows plus I to open settings. Step 2. Select System, then go to Power and Sleep. Step 3. Below Related Settings, click Additional Power Settings. Step 4. Choose Change Plan Settings next to your selected power plan and hit Restore Default Setting for this plan.